Well, I wanted to make another video here. Um, I'm testing out a few things. Um, trying out rafting. And it seems like it's overlapping. I'm, I'm printing multiple parts at once uh, with different settings for each one, different layer heights, different infills, just to get an idea of this creator software, see, um, see what it's really capable of. So I'll have a test here. So I have the uh, twisted ball cage and a ball bearing. And you can go in and add a process. And if you just click select models, you can select just, uh, just for example, the ball cage twist. Click OK. You can change the layer and fill all that information just for that one and save it. And then when you go to prepare, It'll ask if you want to do both at once, and it'll make the G-code for both. And it'll print out in different different settings. So if you just wanted rafting for just that guy, or if you wanted at a higher density, etc. cetera. Um, and then you can go through and you just, if you want to print a couple things at once, different settings, it'll go ahead and do it. You just let it sit. And right now I'm also testing uh, no USB cord attached. So I uploaded that whole file. Just found out through the Maker Gear, Maker Gear uh, Google Groups that you could uh, upload everything on your SD card and just let it go by itself, which I didn't know. So, I think this rafting works. It's been kind of a pain in the ass to get them off the uh, the board. I also have uh, I also tried hairspray for the first time, so we'll see how that works. But I'll I'll update this here when this is done printing. Fun to watch. 